Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Office, Microsoft Word on your Chromebook. So before, Microsoft Office used to be an app on Google Play Store, but if we go to it now, and if we search for it, Microsoft Office won't pop up, and here we do have a couple different options, but if you do want to end up using the Microsoft Office on your Chromebook, all we have to do is go to the Google now we're gonna type in office.com so once we're here if you already have an account like I do all you have to do is sign in you can switch to a different account and for example if you don't have it all you have to do is create an account and this is going to be a free version if you want the paid version of course you have to pay for it so if you want to use the free version make a new account sign in if you already have an account like I do, all we have to do is sign in, enter a password, and here we are. This is the Microsoft Office on a browser on a Chromebook. So here, let me show you the apps that it has. So we have the Outlook, which is the email. We have the OneDrive, Word, Teams, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote. There's a couple different apps here. Now on this front page, what we're gonna see is for example if you have recent documents I haven't done any documents or projects this is kinda newish account and for example if I pinned everything it will show up here and if somebody shared any documents let's say you're in college and you're doing a presentation somebody or a project somebody could share something with you and then you can adjust that project make changes or just read through it and approve and uh, let me show you how the word looks because that's the most important one that most people use again you have the same pin and shared with me but if you just for example want to do just a new blank project so here we are this is how Microsoft Word looks like on your Chromebook it's pretty much in a browser and looks as it should now again you can buy the full version but if you don't want to that's it now after you do your project you can of course save it and um, all the files will be saved to the OneDrive and uh, you can also share or you can copy a link and send it to somebody you can also add comments and uh, let me show you just how the um, how the PowerPoint looks again same thing if you want to do new black blank presentation I'm gonna open it up here we are so this is how the PowerPoint looks and again you have the same thing where you can share it you can comment you can present it and all that so this is quite nice and let's close that so we so I showed you how the word looks how the PowerPoint you also have a couple other apps now one cool thing you can do with this is if you go on the top right and here it's going to say install office it says install app office.com so we're gonna do install so for example now we can just close this browser and close this and alright so now that we did that you will see the Microsoft Office app right here uh, if it's not there, make sure once you go to your apps, all you have to do is just click and drag it on the bottom if that's where you want it. If not, it's going to be right here in your apps. You can also search for it, but for me, I already dragged and it's going to be here. So all we have to do now is just click on it. We don't have to go through the browser. And again, we're going to have our Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, and as I was opening those up, you already saved them. So right now, for example, let's say I do a pin, it's going to show up in pinned. I can remove it, I can share it with somebody. And also I can upload documents if I have them on USB sticks, so I can upload them. Also you can download documents, you can send them through your email and then upload them here. All right, so that's how you use Microsoft Office on your Chromebook. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.